What's good YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. If it's your first time catching one of my videos, welcome to Steps Ahead TV, where we discuss sneakers, streetwear brands, and tips and tricks on how to navigate the sneaker world. You guys don't want to miss out on any of this good content. I can promise you that. So make sure you go ahead and press that like and subscribe button and join the Steps Ahead gang as we're on the road to 1K subs. I appreciate you guys tuning in and to the Steps Ahead gang for continuously pushing my channel and actually supporting my actual content. It definitely goes a long way and I definitely appreciate you guys for that. So in today's episode, I feel like it's going to be a definitely a highly anticipated episode of the Mamba Day, whatever you want to call it. Kobe Bryant jersey that they came out with, special edition one for the Black Mamba himself. So we're gonna go ahead and unbox this actual jersey and see exactly what you get. Now the resale price on this jersey has been pretty high. It's up to like 500 right now, so I definitely wanna see what's inside this box. So let's go ahead and get it open. So before we actually get into the box, I always let you guys know where I was able to pick up the item. So this one right here, I was able to pick up from the Snickers app. So if you don't know, that's pretty much the Jordan and Nikes app where you can go on for a chance to win, you know, limited sneakers and sometimes they drop like jerseys on there, hoodies, it really just depends, but it's pretty much the Nike and Jordan app where you go and for a chance to actually win. So I was able to actually get through on these. I actually did try to get the sneakers that came out the same day. So these actually came out on 0824, so that was Mama Day. So I know the review is a little late, but this is still a hot jersey right now. So before you go pay that resale price, you definitely want to check this video out and just look at you know the actual jersey. So like I said, I was able to pick this up from the sneakers app. Now they did let me in on this, but I tried to go for the shoes and I was you know unsuccessful. But let's go ahead and get into this box right now. So it comes with like some plastic right here. And you guys let me know if you picked up the jersey, what actual site did you go through? Because I know it was more sites than just the sneakers app, but that's the first place that I saw it. So that's the only place that I went to actually try to secure myself the actual jersey. So you guys let me know down in the comment box. So this is the actual box that come in. You already know your sneakers box and it comes in like a wrapping right here. So this is the actual wrapping paper that it comes in with well, plastic that it comes in. So they went ahead and went with the actual black alternate jersey. Now me, only my only thing, I would have liked this on the actual purple. I would have liked to see like purple actual snakeskin, but I get for the whole, you know, black mamba theme, you have to go with the actual black jersey. So pretty much the whole jersey has this whole, it's like python or snakeskin kind of going through the whole jersey. And you have the Kobe Bryant 8 on the front with the Lakers going through it. So it's this new material, so it's not, I wouldn't say it's not stitched, but it's definitely not the press on. You can definitely see that it's something that's definitely not going to come off easily. And, you know, you got your black, you got your yellow going through. You got your black pinstripes on the actual shoulder right here. Then on the bottom, this is a size large. So in the, the actual sizing for the actual Nike jersey is considered a size 48. So I went with a size 48. And then just on the bottom, it says engineered to the exact specifications of championship athletes. So this is definitely just a little barcode on the bottom just to let you know you got an authentic actual jersey. So then on the back side, this is what I like to actually switch it up and put the 24 on the back. So that's definitely something clean that's different that they don't just do on any type of Nike jersey. But of course for the actual Mama Day, they had to you know put their extra little twist on it. It also has that snake skin on the back too which is 24. And, you know what I'm saying, that's pretty much it. But it's definitely a clean jersey. You guys let me know, would you like this in a different type of color? I mean, of course, the all black definitely went with the whole black mama theme. So, I guess, yeah, it only makes sense to go with the all black. But this would look nice on purple, too, with the black actual snake skin. You guys let me know. You also have that Nike tag on the actual back of the jersey. Now, like I said, it's not stitched, but it's, it's a material that you know is not going to come off. It's... I'm not even going to say it's iron on. You guys let me know. I know they definitely changed up the actual uniforms for the actual NBA athletes. So this right here is supposed to be more like a draft fit material. It's definitely clean. Got your, like I said, just all black with the yellow actual stitching on the outside. You got your brand on the back side right here. Definitely a good jersey. Now this jersey is reselling for around... $500 right now. I was able to pick this up for I think like 125 or something like that on the sneakers app So I thought about reselling it then I really thought about it I said, you know, this is something that I think I'm gonna just frame and just keep for a long long time And then maybe later on down the line, but 
Kobe Bryant was one of my favorite players, so it's like, yeah, I can make money off of it, but sometimes, you know, it's not even really about that. So, it's just all about, you know, the symbolicness of his jersey being, you know what I'm saying, something epic for Mamba Day. I definitely think I'm going to keep this in my, you know, hang this up and keep this in my house for a nice period of time. And this is actually, it is dry fit. Now that I look at the actual material on the back, it says dry fit on the back. So like I thought, this is like a dry fit material. It's definitely better than the older jerseys because once the older jerseys got, you know, uh, sweaty, they definitely start to, you know, hang down. With this one right here, you definitely don't have to worry about, you know what I'm saying, sweat actually weighing the jersey down. So this is your Mamba Day edition Kobe Bryant jersey. I just want to give you guys a quick overall review of this jersey to let you guys see the actual details of it because it's definitely clean simple but it's something clean that i know it'll definitely be a good collector's piece if you want to actually add it to your collection and like i say right now it's going for probably like 500 dollars in the actual um adult sizes now kids sizes is probably like 350 so it really just depends you know if you're a real big kobe Bryant fan i definitely think it's worth it you better get it right now because i know the prices on this will only continue to go up so you guys let me know down in the comment box, are you feeling this actual Mamba Day jersey? Are you feeling like it's something that you don't mind adding to your actual collection? And if you were able to pick up those white, gold, and black um, Kobe's that came out on the same day, let me know down in the comment box. Like I said, I was unsuccessful to actually pick them up, but I definitely wanted to add them to my collection. But the resale price, I'll go ahead and hold off on them. I got my one piece out of the actual Mamba Day collection, so I can't even really be mad. So. I appreciate you guys just tuning in for a quick, you know, overview of this actual Mamba Day jersey. I definitely feel like it's a good piece if you have it in your actual collection, if you were successful. Definitely think it's something you should keep in your collection for a while. But some people, you know, get things just to resale. But either way, I appreciate you guys tuning in to another video over here on the Steps Ahead channel. Steps Ahead gang, you guys already know. Let's continue to grow. And if you haven't already, go ahead and press that like and subscribe button so you stay up to date on all the content that we drop over here on Steps Ahead TV. Thanks for tuning in. Peace.